Hello, my name is Martin Rock. I'm the lead organiser for SIPTU in Belfast. Uh, we're running a campaign right across the north in relation to community sector organisations. My role predominantly is to try and coordinate to bring community sector workers together to act as a collective. Very often when community sector organisations are working on all our behalfs in the communities, there's nobody looking after their back. That's why over the last two years our estimation is that 10% of community sector workers have lost their jobs. This can't continue because society will have to pay a big price if it does and we're calling upon all community sector workers to join SIPTU, to join our campaign and help us achieve a fair and better future for all. My name is Kevin McKinney from SIP2. I'm the industrial official for Northern Ireland and for Donegal. My main focus would be organising workers and representing them with their issues. That can be anything from negotiating pay claims in terms of conditions of employment to individual grievance and disciplinary handling. There's a real importance, especially now more than ever, that workers become organised. We're a good dynamic union. We take care of lots of workers across of, of lots of different types of employment. And to that end, I think we've been very, very successful. And we're certainly the largest union in Ireland and growing in Northern Ireland. And that's very, very important and key. Hello, my name is Anne Thompson and I'm the administrator in SIP2, the trade union. I've worked here for 12 years and my job is basically taking care of the members and the needs of the members. So uh, you come to me first with anything and I will decide who is best to uh, help you. I, I would also get you on a training course if you wanted to go on a training course, sort you out with conferences if you're going. I would deal with the financial and administrative aspects of your membership. Hello, I'm Brenda Callahan. I'm an organiser with the trade union SIP2. Part of my role is to encourage members to join SIP2. Um, SIP2 is a very democratic union who look to its members to ensure that we are representing their best interests. At present I am working with people employed by Boots and in the community sector. Um, the Boots campaign has been one which has been triggered by them reducing um, workers pay by 7% and we're working very hard to try to rectify that using all legal means possible to us. The campaign for the community is an excellent campaign because not only will we organise what is a very large area and not very structured, but we will also be able to um, assist them in campaigning to secure funds in the present environment. Hey there, I'm Nell McNally, an organiser with SEP2 Trade Union. Uh, my job would entail uh, assisting workers uh, get getting organised. Currently I'm working on the Communities Uniting campaign and the Boots campaign. Um, doing a lot of work, what we feel is very important is outreaching to people and uh, going in and speaking to workers on a face-to-face -face basis as well as um, a lobbying aspect. Very important that the trade union can provide both an organisational know-how and support to workers, whether that be in the community sector or, or Boots. Um, very uh, privileged to actually work for SEP2 uh, and uh, more so now than ever it is very important that workers galvanise themselves together in creating a collective voice, one voice, uh, so that their demands and issues are met no matter what sector of employment they're in. Yes, no that's fine, no I'll see you at 2 o'clock this afternoon. Alright, look forward to seeing you. Bye bye. Hello, my name is Terry Cregan. I'm an organiser with SIP2 Trade Union and we feel it is very important for the community sector to have a voice. Uh, at the moment, there's only about 7% organised into the community sector, organised into unions. Um, at the moment, they don't have a choice of decisions being made at the decision making table. And obviously, the more people that get organised into unions, the bigger voice that community sector workers and volunteers will have. So it's extremely important that everyone comes together and works in a cohesive manner. I've been in a union all my life and uh, the union has helped me on many, many occasions, even for background stuff, but on the bigger issues, 
it's so important for people to get involved in this big campaign within the community sector and we're here to represent you.